In this video, we're going to talk about the color sync uh, inside of Cricut Design Space version 3. And it's found right here, the color sync panel. And there's a paragraph that's right above this that sort of explains exactly what this will do for us. Uh, allows us to sync colors uh, so that we can use fewer materials because when we click on the make it button and I want to demonstrate this here I have I have this skunk over here uh, the color if you can't see it it's really like a, a brownish black and then I have this skunk over here that's a gray and we can sort of visually see this right here in the color sync panel but if I click on make it it's go I'm going to be presented with seven mats seven materials that uh, you know, Cricut Design Space is saying that I'm going to need for this project. So, Color Sync is a way for you to reduce the number of mats that you would need uh, uh, based upon the material. So, let's go ahead, take a look. How can we do this? So, in the Color Sync tab, uh, you, you know, you can individually, you know, you know, say for example, I wanted to ensure that uh, the skunk that I have right here, this, this one right here, uh, can be the same color as this so it shows up on the, on the same mat. So if you remember, uh, if I go ahead and drop and drag this to here, it will now assume that color uh, of that skunk. And now, uh, essentially when I click make it, I went from seven mats down to six. So uh, it, it saved me a material. Now let's take a look at it when we have a lot of items that we would like to shift to a color. So uh, this example right here, I just have some hearts. Uh, obviously you can uh, drag and drop them individually, but then you know that sort of gets tedious. What we can do with Cricut Design Space uh, version 3 is I can take the entire layer. So take a look at this. I got this group of three. If I click on the blue tab here, I can go ahead and drag it up there and now I just change the color. So it uh, makes it very easy when you're trying to consolidate uh, and save material with color sync because uh, any variation of the color you will have a new mat when you click on the Make It button. So, hey, thanks for watching, everyone. I'm Rob with ScrappyDoo.com. If you like this video, make sure you give us a thumbs up. Check out the description below. We have a lot more videos in the description that will uh, help you learn Design Space 3.